so hey guys welcome back to this channel we'll be drawing this in which this is hit in 2d and coming to our interface you go to file new create yada yada so you come here you pick your line to you touch the center then drag up slide out this direction then right click and okay then the next thing you want to pick is dimension to touch here and touch here drag it out which this height was 32 enter let me zoom into my diagram then the next one you want to do is you want to touch down here and this point this point which is also 62 enter then sorry zoom out now you want to touch this midpoint i'd love to zoom in to get my point this midpoint and this end and drag out which was 20 20 enter then you want to come to fillet 20 mm 20 mm then you want to touch this guy and this guy so it bends you press finish sketch sorry finish sketch so now we are going to our yz plane then at this sketch yeah sorry we want to draw a line or two lines so you click on line sorry let me zoom in line green make sure it's straight as always then drag it left towards right click and okay so you pick your dimension to again this line you just touch the line drag out this line should be high 62 zoom out so then this line you click on this end so this end drag upwards it should be 30 30 right then you pick your fillet to again fillet to still 20 mm 20 mm done then you can finish sketch next you want to come to this place remember i didn't click on this up i click on 2d then i'm changing it to 3d then i'm touching intersection curve now it's telling me to pick my point one and point two in which this is my point one and this is my point two i click on okay and it does this and i click on finish sketch so we want to go under net that's the y z no xz yeah under xz then edit we want to draw a circle down here with diameter 15 circle then 15 enter then we click on done i will come to sweep then touch our circle okay circle is touch and this yellow line yeah then this is done okay okay so the next thing to do is click on flip right touch what would you want to flip then tell it what axis yeah it's our yz axis yz axis then you click on okay click on fillet right touch the center line here and make it 5 mm enter now we'll be rotating the drawing we want to look at the front and down yeah something like this click on shell then touch each holes okay in case you are stocks like me who is having this you can always click right click then click on visibility like toggle of visibility so let's source things up by giving this a semi steel color so let's polish it yeah now looking like something engineer is working on then the next one wants to go to our yz plane right and edit sorry let me zoom out well yeah then you want to click on this to cut a little bit of this portion 
So the next thing you want to do after cutting this out is you want to click on this. Then yeah, this is our Y Z X Y. Okay, yeah, X Y. You can see it became yellow. Let me type click on X Y. Then you want to come to line. So we want to draw this straight line. Don't forget up, left, up, right, and this way. Then we'll be adjusting it all together. Okay, so what you want to do next after drawing this line is clicking on this guy, right? Then touching this, so it becomes a thin dash line. Then you click on dimension, you touch this junction. So this just touch this wall and drag it down, right? So this is going to be 20 right so you can see it's measuring on both sides it's trying to tell us that we are doing like a circle not just here to here it's doing what is half here is also half replicated here so we do the same thing dimension is on torch this guy extend to this middle line then bring it downwards and this is 25 click enter then the height here is four on dot four enter then the height from here to here is nine nine enter then for this place you want to zoom in as much as possible double click at this junction yeah so it's showing us an angle so we want to do angle 45 yeah that's it then finish sketch so next off is clicking on revolve yeah it has done its job nothing to edit work here then click on chamfer now we want to go under to touch sorry let me make it visible enough so you can you can see what i'm touching yeah to touch this guy and okay yeah, you can see what happened there. It's not as fat as, or the tip is fatter than the normal inner diameter. As you can see, it's hollow. You can see it through, right? Yeah. So let's go back to normal and click home. Okay. So next, we want to click on front. Then we want to click on 2D sketch and torch, right? Sorry, let me zoom in. Then you click on circle two. Now you reflect on this circle. Can you see it was green before, but it changed to blue. Then you slide to the center and draw. You want to see that blue line. Don't forget, touch the circle first. Don't click, just place your mouse cursor on it. Then it, turn, it turns to blue. Then you drag to the center. You go to the center when it gives you a green line, then you drag. So 26, enter. The same thing here again. Touch first, it becomes blue. Then come to the center and drag then 26 again enter then after drawing you want to come to project geometry line then you touch here you can see it's blue and it's like i'm touching the tangent then let's click you can see a tangent sign can you see this tangent sign then you drag it to this other tangent you can see the sign is giving me also can you see that's a tangent sorry let me sketch yeah, do the same line here and drag to this point. Yes. So the next thing you want to do is pick up circle two, just somewhere close by here, drag in the center there, then 4.5, enter. With that same center, drag again, 10, enter. Come to this other side, you do the same thing, drag. 4.5 enter the center again drag you put 10 enter then you want to pick your dimension or before you pick dimension to so come to horizontal constraint touch on the center of these three circles or four circles sorry yeah to tell them align yourself so it's all aligned we didn't make any mistakes so you click on your dimension to touch the body of this circle and the body of this circle. Um, let me zoom out, sorry. 
zoom out 66 and uh okay so now there's something i need you guys to pay attention to right when i double click on this guy you can you see this number it may vary yours may be d28 but please cram this your number mine here is d27 so i click ok right then i touch this circle with diameter with, with my dimension to on right i touch this circle diameter 10 right you can see i'm dragging my hand and it's telling me that's my circle diameter 10 then i touch this yellow dot. you can see me touching it becomes green then i drag it upwards right then okay let me drag it up here when i double click on that to edit it remember i told you to cram it so you put d27 slash 2 and press enter so it aligns everything then you finish your sketch okay next thing you want to do is clicking on extrude right so i touch okay we make this 5 mm for thickness then you touch this guy please before you left click make sure you are seeing the green lights yes this guy no not the full circle just not the not the full circle sorry zoom in to be sure yeah this guy and this guy so zoom out again confirm this guy yes i want all of that guy then let's zoom in on this sorry i've zoomed out too far so let me zoom in again yes i want all of this guy yes this guy and this guy yeah so let me zoom out so you can see everything i just alight and let me go sideways so you can see everything 0 0.5 then want to go backwards inwards and not cut it's this and okay yo now we rotate to the back right sorry back here then we click on chamfer then we click on chamfer make our chamfer one mm in distance one then this sorry this guy this guy then we rotate it back to the front again hey what did i just do rotate it yes i want to touch this guy and i want to touch this guy so i click apply So, fire again 0 0.25 then we'll be chamfering sorry we'll be chamfering this guy this guy and this guy that's the outer circle okay then next we want to pick fillets make our fillets five then rotate this okay you touch this first then we want to touch this no okay i think i have to rotate so you guys can see uh, this guy fillet i need him upside down i touch this guy and i touch this guy and i click on my okay and i go back home again we click on chamfer 0 0.25 this front and this back yeah, total and we click OK. Alright guys, that's all for the diagram. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Bye and peace out.